This is an Efficiencies Everything article summary on paper products per dollar. So the idea here is that we're going to compare toilet paper, napkins, and paper towel to figure out what is the best way to clean up a mess, whether it's on yourself or on the floor, and you know the most optimal as far as spending money. So I'll start with, if you're going to clean up water, just use a towel. You don't need to use paper towel. You don't need something disposable. Just use a towel, right? Um, but if for everything else, we'll say look at these disposable products. So meters squared per dollar, we found that generic one ply came up as number one. Uh, and shortly behind it, uh, this family napkins brand and uh, Angel Soft. So surprisingly, a brand name toilet paper company got on there. Maybe they have really good technology and can make cheap toilet paper. Uh, but whatever the case, uh, it seems that like very low cost, uh, potentially like thin paper is really showing up high there. And actually, on a similar note, when it came to absorption, that one-ply toilet paper showed up best because it, there's just so much of it that you can get. So I think the best time to use this for absorption is, say you spill just tons of maple syrup on the floor, um, maybe this one-ply would be good for that. I feel like this stuff has actually happened in my life, whether it was at work or at home. I've actually had to clean up non-water messes and using a bunch of really like low-cost um, paper products was my best option. And finally, we did a strength test and we found that none of these like low-cost toilet papers that were one ply uh, could really hold up to anything, but uh, paper towels, premium napkins, and even premium toilet paper could uh, actually hold some weight. So um, kind of those are yes, no kind of thing and I have that in the article. And kind of as a result, when I originally did the study, I picked Brawny as my number one. I think I'm less brand de dependent. I even with like a really say, high quality brawny that is low cost, um, I don't think I'd get that much of a difference over just picking the lowest price. So maybe something to consider, just pick the lowest one and you don't need the strength. Um, anyway, so be careful about being marketed to. I remember when I did the study, my wife was in the aisle and she saw some uh, movie, had characters on the toilet paper, well, I can't remember what it was, but my wife was all excited about this. So careful because you might uh, be buying things because of some corporate mascot on it. So, all right, everyone. Well, have a good day, and sorry about the one-day delay. Take care.